This is Kate Krieger with the Mason County Press webcast, and I am joined with Eric Smith and Sue Carlson, librarians at the Mason County District Library of Ludington. I'm used to calling it the Ludington Library, so I had the I had the practice I had the practice that before I got here. And we're here to talk about the kickoff to the summer reading program that you guys do every year. And this will be Eric's first year because he is our new uh, library director or head librarian or whatever you just told me that you were that I already forgot. So welcome. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hello. So why don't you guys tell me a little bit about what this year's theme for the program is. The theme for the year is Every Hero Has a Story. Um, and I think we're very excited about this theme because we're all kind of nerds already and we <laughs> like the idea of having superheroes be part of the summer reading program. It also comes with a really built-in excitement level. I mean, everybody is watching Marvel movies. Right. And, and so we're already at a really high level of excitement, just starting with the theme. Um, and it, yeah, it, the staff has costumes. Several yeah. people already are. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Several people are already. All right. <laughs> that's, uh, wow, that's pretty intense. Um, yeah, like you said, there's been so many, like, superhero movies and mm -hmm. the kids, like, the stuff when I was younger has kind of come back. Yeah. But you never lose Batman, Superman, all those kind of things. So with the Avengers and Thor and I don't, right, exactly. I don't know. Oh, any of and we will we'll be concentrating on local heroes as well. I mean, we're oh, cool. having firefighters come to the Scottville Library and having uh, um, people that work with animals come to the Scottville Library, like short animal friends, animal oh, heroes, great. or heroes for animals, I great. guess. But, so other kinds of heroes as well. But superheroes will be lots of fun. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, definitely. And the program kicks off this Friday. That's right. The kickoff party is Friday. Batman and Batgirl will be here. Now, what time is the kickoff party? The kickoff party is 7 to 9 p.m. The library closes at 6, and we won't open for the party till about 10 minutes before 7. Okay. okay. So, um, and it's just open for the party, so we won't be able to let people do other things. It's just for the kids' party okay. from 7 to 9. So no checking out books and no, none of that no. kind of stuff. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And how long does the whole summer reading program actually start? The entire summer. Okay. It starts actually before they're out of school, and it ends, I mean, when they go back to school. Okay, so basically so. Friday till... Labor Day. Right, exactly. Okay. okay. So. And tell me a little bit about the program because I'm pretty sure it's changed a lot since I used to be involved in it back in the <laughs> 80s and 90s. Right. What, what do they have to do in order to... Right. Well, the summer reading program itself is really simple. Um, the kids sign up. They uh, get a book bag. They go home and read books and keep track of the time they spend reading. So for every 20 minutes, they get a sticker on their sheet. Oh, okay. And after they filled up half their sheet with stickers, they get prizes. And we have lots of local prizes. And I I know I won't be able to mention everyone. I won't think of it. So that's really, I have no idea. That's yeah, awesome, been though, that around asking so for many it. local people oh, have yeah, always local, been on oh, yeah. board. So. They really participate and help that's us out, great. and we have lots of cool local prizes to give kids for summer reading. That's awesome. And when they finish, they get a book. We always give books away. Okay. The books that we give away, I mean, it comes from a special program, so they're scholastic paperback books for cheap um, but they, the friends of the library support that. The schools, the teachers are bringing classes in for me to talk about the summer reading program. Oh, okay. And the importance of summer reading. Great. It's my motivational speaker moment. It, but it's such a good thing because you do, they do like the Dibbles testing. For those that don't know, it's like a fluency testing mm -hmm. at the end of the year. Well, they do it throughout the year, but at the end of the year. Then they do one at the beginning of the year. And I'm sure there's a, you know, a slide backwards okay, so for a lot talk, of kids. Okay, so let's do this. All right, let's talk about that. And it's not, right, the summer reading program is uh, extremely important. I mean, it is it is vital to your child's future. Reading there is, is extremely no, important. Right, good, you know, and this is what I tell the kids. Good readers have all the choices in the world. Mm -hmm. When you grow up, if you're a good reader, and how you get good at something is practice. And right. how you practice reading is by reading. Right. The summer reading program is just, I mean, to get all the prizes is just 20 minutes a day. 
20 minutes. That's all. If you signed up somebody who isn't able to read, like a four, three or four year old, oh, if a no, parent yeah, reads. Babies can sign up and the parents can read to them. Really? Oh, yeah, Steph. The summer, what's called the summer slide is real. It is a fact. This is um, six decades of research on children and reading. If they don't read during the summer, they will lose some of their skills. 20 minutes. That's nothing. That's shorter than watching a cartoon. And they're not even being forced to, you know, have to read an autobiography this no, time. Or no, have to exactly. Read well, no, and that's, that's the thing the, about the summer reading. It, this story. is reading for fun. Right. This is reading for fun. You read whatever you want. Tell me again, Friday from 7 to 9. Is the summer reading kickoff party with Batman and Bat. We continue to grow all the time. What is the website that people can check out all this information? mcdlibrary.org. All right. Well, And also like us on Facebook. There's oh. a lot of activity on oh, Facebook. Yes. The Facebook. The Book of Face. That's right. Yeah, That's... and like us on Facebook and we're you know, we we're doing stuff on there daily. And basically. listing everything. Mm -hmm. Well, I appreciate you guys meeting with me. Well, thank you. And, yeah, I and appreciate the chance. I hope to that like... everybody comes out read. and Yeah. Read <laughs> and come out on uh, on Friday to uh, is that can they sign up? Friday? Or can I sign oh, up I can already? Sign up for summer reading on Friday. We'll start Friday. Okay, I'm, we'll start Friday. Ready. All right. <laughs> gotcha. All right. Well, I appreciate it, you guys, and uh, hopefully you have a good turnout on Friday. Oh, we will. All right. Yeah. Great. Thanks so much. <laughs> Thanks, Kate.